Hello, I'm really tired, but I found this um, <clears throat> interesting poem online from worldprayers.org, and I'm going to try and read it. Um, I think it's a Christian prayer, but I also think it is just kind of general, so um, I like that. I wasn't really prepared to do a video, I'm just um, going to try and see what happens. So um, this is from The Dominion of Dreams, Under a Dark Star by Fiona McLeod, um, 1895. It's pretty long, so we'll see if I can get through it. <clears throat> Deep Peace. I breathe into you. O oh, weariness here, O oh, ache here. Deep peace, a soft white dove to you. Deep peace, a quiet rain to you. Deep peace, an ebbing wave to you. Deep peace, red wind of the east from you, deep peace, gray wind of the west to you, deep peace, dark wind of the north from you, deep peace, blue wind of the south to you, deep peace, pure red of the flame to you, Deep peace, pure white of the moon to you. Deep peace, pure green of the grass to you. Deep peace, pure brown of the earth to you. Deep peace, pure gray of the dew to you. Deep peace, pure blue of the sky to you. Deep peace of the running of deep peace of the running wave to you. Deep peace of the flowing air to you. Deep peace of the quiet earth to you. Deep peace of the sleeping stones to you. Deep peace of the yellow shepherd to you. Deep peace of the wandering shepherdess to you. Deep peace of the flock of stars to you. Deep peace from the sun of peace to you. Deep peace from the heart of Mary to you. And from Bridget of the mantle, deep peace, deep peace. And with the kindness, too, of the <clears throat> haughty Father, peace. In the name of three who are one, peace. And by the will of the King of the Elements, peace, peace. And that's um, on worldprayers.org, the dominion of dreams under a dark star. I hope that ends up peaceful. <laughs> Fiona McLeod, 1895. Um, it's interesting, I didn't read it through before um, wondering if it was Christian, but it definitely is um, because it speaks of the Trinity. And it's interesting on here they have the word haughty and with the kindness two of the haughty father so i don't know if that's a typo or if that's just from back then um 1895 so i like this because um i think whether you belong whatever religion or non-religion or atheism or agnosticism you belong to um i think when we do prayer and meditation for me at least um, 
my goal is to find a deep peace and I think that's what I really like this about this and I also like the nature elements um, that really speaks to me um, and again I think in any religion or non-religion we often turn to nature um, to feel God's presence, higher power's presence, the universe's presence, spirit's presence, whatever, to get grounded and I, you know, and for that peace. Um, and actually studies have been done that when people are in nature, they're, I think they're more calm. Um, so I, I um, picked this one from World Prayers today and I, I made it through, I actually was able to read it all, which is pretty incredible. So um, if deep peace is what you need, um, then I wish that for you. I think we could all, all benefit from a sense of deep peace um, throughout our days, throughout our nights, and um, throughout our lives. So. Um, Thanks for watching this.